Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Jay. As you can see, I got my co-pilots here with me today. Um, we're watching the winner of our most recent poll today. We're watching Hot Fuzz. I don't know really anything about Hot Fuzz other than the fact that it has some of the people from China Dead. Blank told me that he think I would like this one better than China Dead. I told him, of course, I'm going to like it better because it don't have zombies in it. Because as y'all know, zombies are gross. I don't like gross stuff. That's not saying I don't think Chandler Dead ain't funny. It was hilarious. But it was gross. Um, I'm super excited to get into this because I've heard people say this is a really funny movie. And it won the poll by a pretty good amount. So I'm really looking forward to getting into it. So... Before we get started, I need you to do me a favor. I need you to hit that like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget that bell notification. Don't forget, um, forget to check us out on Patreon. You get early access to all my full length videos. You get exclusive TV shows and movies. And you also get access to our weekly poll. Don't forget to check us out on social media. I also want to point out, I now have my Autograph Muhammad Ali boxing gloves hung up. I couldn't find a case for it yet. But with that being said, I'll see you on the other side. Let's get it. Hey, he walking serious as Police Constable Nicholas Angel. Oh, he's definitely a tryhard in Call of Duty. Displayed great aptitude in field exercises. Received the baton of honor. Graduated with distinction into the Metropolitan Police Service. Oh, he a badass. Hello, Nicholas. Hello, Sergeant. Shut up. Got my dude in it. We're making you Sergeant. I see. In Sanford, Gloucestershire. In where, sorry? In Sanford, Gloucestershire. That's... In the country. Yes. Lovely. Oh, they, they transfer him out. I don't really know what to say. Yes. Yes, thank you. He's definitely a trial heart. The fact is, you've been making us all look bad. I'm sorry, sir. Shut the f up. You'll put us all out of a job. You can't just make people disappear. Yes, I can. I'm the chief inspector. And that's f up. There's one thing you haven't taken into account, and that's what the team is going to make of this. <laughs> they think it's Janine, I've been transferred. I'm moving away for a while. I'm not Janine. <clears throat> Janine, I've been transferred. I'm moving away for a while. I know. It's only ever about the job. It's all you care about. That's not true. You just can't switch off, Nicholas. And until you find a person you care about more than your job, you never will. Hey, she got some pretty ass eyes. Actually, there's something I need to tell you. You're seeing someone else? Yes, how did you... Is it Bob? No, it's Dave. Hello there. <laughs> he gonna say hello there. <laughs> hey, this is so f***ed up. They got rid of my man because he was doing too good. He don't even have no service on his phone. Hey, man, his mustache was elite. I was hoping to uh, check in. But you've always been here. Excuse me. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought you were my husband. You must be Sergeant Angel. Yes, I am. Oh, I thought it was about to be some shiny Pleasant trip, fascist. I beg your pardon? Seven across. Oh, I see. It's uh, fascism. Hag. I beg your pardon? It's 12 down. Oh, bless you. Hey, he called her a hag. I don't give a fuck what the... He called her a hag. I want to call somebody a hag. I've never called somebody a hag. Yo, hag. Find the log, please, Mary. I was wondering if he was in this. 
You wouldn't by any chance be the new policeman. Police officer, yes. I'm Nicholas Angel. Um, is this same boy from Challenge of Dead? Do you not like kids? Oh. When's your birthday? 22nd of February. What year? Every year. Get out. When's your birthday? 1969. You're 37. Yeah. Get out. When's your birthday? Uh, out. <laughs> the law's the law, and they'll have to go. Oh. oh, yeah, he he was a dickhead cop. I ain't say Another cranberry juice? I'm fine, thank you. I ain't say he wrong from stopping the kids from drinking, but he was a dickhead. He was a dickhead cop. Yeah. That's why they gave rid of him. Right. I'm taking you to the station. Where is it? Shut the f up. <clears throat> wow. Damn, he just gonna piss on him? Nicholas Angel. He ain't been there a whole day. He got six arrests. You really want to uh, process all this lot? My pen's running out. Not a problem. So he ain't got no friends. He's never had a friend in life. Yeah, they they had him at that last place. I get why they wanted him gone. I wouldn't even throw my party. He's gone. Oh my god. Who's gone? Shut the f up. Why are you dressed like a police officer? Because I am one. Shut the f up. I see you've already met my boy. Yes. That's f hilarious. Statistically, Sanford is the safest village in the country. But that doesn't mean it requires anything less than a careful and considered approach. He gonna go crazy there. Let's have a mosey around. Riot room! What kind of creature was that? I know there wasn't a rat. What was it? Why have you got your stab vest on? It's a requirement. In the city, maybe. Have you been stabbed, Sergeant Fisher? You? Well, I have. And I can assure you it is not the least bit amusing. And he's so serious. Everybody and their mums is packing around there. Like who? Farmers. Who else? Farmers' mums. <laughs> Farmers. Who else? Farmers' mums. Ever been in high speed pursuit? Yes, I have. You ever find a gun whilst in high speed pursuit? No. Sergeant Angel's coming into your shop. Can I look at his arms? <laughs> what about lethal weapon? No. You seen Die or Do? No. Bad Boys too? Hey, man. He's asking so many questions. I would go crazy. I can't handle all those questions. I'm open to the concept of religion. I'm just not entirely convinced by it. You're an agnostic. I think I have a cream for that. <laughs> <laughs> And my man's so serious. I don't think he's cracked a real smile this whole movie. Sergeant Angel. Morning, the swans escaped. The swans escaped. And who might you be? Yeah, Mr. Peter Ian Staker. P.I. Staker. Yeah. Right. Piss Taker. Come on! Yes, Mr. Staker. Um, we'll do everything we can. <laughs> oh, that is great. All right. What about this guy? Ask yourself, why has he got his hat pulled down like that? He's fuck ugly. <laughs> Real name Michael Armstrong. Uh huh. Dad says he's got a child's mind. Okay. Lives up Summer Street with his mum and his sister. And are they as big as his? Who? The mum and the sister. Same person. What the f he say? He said the same person. Oh, the daddy nasty. Excuse me. Super cop. 
Meet the cop. I've never seen that. I ain't gonna lie. Chopper! I'm impressed the dude in purple can run that fast. Morning target. Hey man, if you if he quit looking back, he'd be alright. Come on. Through the gardens. What's the matter, Danny? You never taken a shortcut before. How's that a shortcut? Hey, bro. Hey, give me that. I don't blame him. Hey, that's a bad man. Did that say Peacocker? Have you ever seen Point Break? No. I have not seen Point Break. I just feel like I'm missing out sometimes. I want to do what you do. You do do what I do. No, you don't. It's not all about gunfights and car chases. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. Scared the f*** out of me. What are you writing? Everything you're saying, I might need to refer to it later. This is preposterous. Preposterous. Look, stop writing! Stop writing. Hey, man, this dude's a dickhead for real. This is the most important piece of equipment you will ever own. This notebook has saved my skin more times than I care to mention. Oh, I do use mine. Show me. That's just extra. I ain't gonna lie. Hey. That's, hey. That's badass. Now, Mr. Blower left you tickets for Romeo and Juliet. Said it was by way of an apology. Well, we can't accept gifts from somebody we've officially rebuked, so... Glad I caught you. Wondered if you wouldn't mind representing us at the Amdrams tonight. Yes, sir. And there's a spare for Danny, too. Hey! Shut the f up. <sighs> yeah, listen, I'm gonna tell you. I don't care how much I love you. I'm not poisoning myself because I thought you was dead. I'm not doing it. They did not have girls of Romeo and Juliet. Hopefully, that's the last we'll see of him. F is Jigsaw doing it this? Mm. <laughs> you haven't got long. Uh, also, she is Miss Blower. Who is it? <laughs> oh, I was just joking about the Jigsaw sh Decaffeinated. I thought. Little Brian Libby found him. He will be having nightmares for a while. The f I didn't know they actually had more murders in this movie. Hey, why can't we see accident again? Because accident implies there's nobody to blame. Poor sock in it, town mouse. Yeah, you want to be a big cop in a small town? Hey. What is that? They're eating, man. What else you got? Crockett and Tubby. Skid marks. <laughs> now was being childish. There were no skid marks at the scene. Oh. I ain't gonna lie, I thought it was doo-doo stains too. I was like, why are you talking about doo-doo stains? Old Arthur Webley's been clipping hedgerows that don't belong to him. Yes, sir. That's it. Yes, sir. Is that um, Professor Slughorn? Why do we need the dog? <laughs> it's not the dog we need. Because it's the puppy. Shut the f up! Mr. Webley, I trust you have a license for that firearm. I don't for this one. He does for this one. Just for this one. Shut the f up! By the power of Grayskull! Where on earth did you get these? First off, that's a dope ass He-Man reference. Hey, and this moment. This. What is that? Sea mine. Sea mine. Why do he got a sea mine? I use a lot of junk. Shut the f 
Yeah, but it blow up. That's disappointing. They took his gun? I don't know why I asked. I, I should have known. He arrested little kids and What made you want to be a policeman? Officer. What made you want to be a policeman officer? A policeman officer. I don't remember a time when I didn't want to be a police officer. Apart from the summer of 1979 when I wanted to be Kermit the Frog. I mean, Kermit the Frog is that dude. I got beaten up a lot when I was young, but it didn't stop me. I probably deserved it. I had to prove to myself that the law could be proper and for the good of humankind. It was from that moment I was destined to be a police officer. We dream different. I think you would have made a great Muppet. <laughs> <laughs> you finally got a friend. Hey, what's this? Ah! Jesus Christ! Oh, oh my eye! <laughs> Ta da! <laughs> Y'all don't understand what happened to my stomach just now. Y'all have no fucking idea. It was one of those things you were so horrified you can't turn your head. What say we drink to their demise? Shouldn't that be drink to their memories? Of course. Cheers. Hey man, he's he's real super villainous. Is that what I'm saying that right? I think somebody needs to go home. I'm, I'm not that drunk, sir. I mean, because he, he did say earlier when he first met him, him that he needs to be stopped. He's a slasher. What, what the f I would not want to be here in the morning. Is Skinner the, the killer? So who's killing these people in this little ass town? And why did they wait to Robocop get here to want to do this Janine used to say I love my Lily more than I loved her. Because you've done it with a plan. No, no, no. Is it because you did it with a plan? I can show you how. Christ, Carl. I, I'm telling you, I love the human reference. <laughs> I can't watch this. I've never seen this movie. I know it's playing break because I know what Bad Boys 2 look like. No way you could perpetrate that amount of carnage and mayhem and not incur a considerable amount of paperwork. It's nothing, man. This is about to go off. He talking about paperwork. <laughs> That makes sense why he was cooking them breakfast. People eat beans for breakfast? Ew. Nasty way to go. I mean, they had to show that. They did not have to show that. Friends, they seem to do a thorough sweep of the house. Very good. What he said. Actually, I just wanted to ask, what's your perfect Sunday? I'll deal with the press, Sergeant. I ain't gonna lie to you. I don't trust the little reporter, dude. And I'm gonna tell you why. Because of screen too. I don't trust this screen. But they want us to think it's him. All right, so we got a who done it now. I gotta figure out who done it. The victims knew each other. Uh, everyone knows everyone around there. Yeah. If you didn't see anything suspicious, and who did? <laughs> I like the re up the little. Black the rat. Shark! Shut up! Oh my god. I know y'all are laughing. I don't care. I'm just my ass. Sergeant? <laughs> <laughs> Why he caress it like that? Dear Lord. That was amazing. Uh, 
never shot anyone before. Danny, believe me, it's not something you ever get used to. Hey, how did he do that? Simon Skinner. He's in the loo! Nah, he's the murderer. Oh, he gone, folks. Oh. Oh. oh, they did not have to do that. Oh, my God. Stand back, there's been a terrible accident. You don't f***ing say. Are you saying that this is a crime scene? Yes, sir, I am. Where the f*** is Skinner? Well, did you go to his house? Did you, did you read his articles? Oh, if you want to wait for every copy of the staff of Bloody Citizen, be our guest. It's your job, isn't it? Detect! And they are, they are terrible at their job. You and your monkey. Did he mean me or that? Hey, man, I realized he got, he got the damn cap on his little cowboy hat. I just realized that. You said I could be an amazing policeman officer. There's always something going on, Danny. You don't know how to switch off. Why he run off like a little girl? So is it Mr. Mergent? Danny, I think I'm onto something. Are you? We can figure out what links these deaths. We? Come on, partner. Let's go to work. The guy's so excited. I mean, they got a lot of information. He's good. They way better than f***ing detectives. Maybe they were all accidents. Oh, people have accidents every day. <laughs> what are you two up to? He about to lose his mind. You know that fella who blew up? George Merchant. George Merchant got dressed and wanted to buy this land. So he sent around his legal fella. Oh, she about to get killed. Thanks for playing. You're talking too much. You're about to be gone. I might take them up on the offer and move. You're about to move straight to heaven. And then that reporter, God rest him, finds out about the route and tells me this land is very valuable. Oh, yeah, she's gone, folks. Yeah. Would you just excuse me for just one second? Woo! Hey, hey, bro. Hey, she gone. Oh, they don't have guns in like over there, do they? Like that? Cause he ain't got a gun on him, do he? I have a bag full of rocks and some. You're saying this wasn't an accident? Leslie Tiller was fucking murdered. How? How was that? How was that accident? Accidents happen all the time. What makes you think it was murder? <laughs> because I was there! I chased a suspect from the scene. Innocent people don't run. They all in on it. Everybody's a suspect. Sir, you have to understand. No, you have to understand. I bet he's in on it. Him, him and Skinner is in on it. There hasn't been a recorded murder in Santa for 20 years. Him, Skinner, and the dude that looks at the camera. To what do I owe this pleasure? Simon Skinner, I'm arresting you on suspicion of the murder of Leslie Tiller. I mean, that's true. Yeah, he's good. And isn't it true that two of your own employees operate the vehicle remover service for the council? Yes. Sarge, this is the 21st century. Hey, he is good. I'm sure the store's security footage will absolve me. Do feel free to spool through. <laughs> That's a nice touch. I like how he was smiling right next to his picture. Hey, look. Look, Mr. Treacher's got his big coat on again. <laughs> hey, they broke him. He's broken. No luck catching them killers, then. It's just the one killer, actually. It's the, hey, this turned them on to the idea of, of, of multiple killers. I told you, I think it's Skinner and his daddy. It's just the one killer, actually. So, Mario, you got brain freeze? Oh, I got brainwave. Get us back to the station now. <laughs> I want to drive one of the little ass cars. You've come from a city where there's danger around every corner, and it's driven you round the bend. 
Yes. Do yourself a favor. I'm telling you, I swear I think it's him. Hey, what's happening? What's going on? Nothing. Yo, Daddy Cricket. I don't know why I'm so convinced on him, but I am. Shut up. That's that big motherfucker, ain't it? That's Lurch. He is whooping his ass. Shut the fuck up. Hey, Biggin. Playtime's over. This dumbass will fall for that damn lullaby. Michael. Is everything okay? Yeah. Yarp. That's what it is, Yarp. I'm gonna go after him, okay? Uh, it, it's Nicholas, by the way. Shut up. Wait. If I need this. Oh my god. That literally massacred the piss out of me. Oh. It's the Illuminati. Now, quick announcement before we begin. Janet Barker has decided to call her boys Roger and Martin. And the christening will be a week on Saturday, and we're all invited. First off, why are y'all talking about that in a secret murder ritual? Second, I was really wrong, wasn't I? Nothing will stand in our way. Oh, I beg to differ, Mr. Weaver. Sergeant Nicholas Angel, Sanford Police Service. Hey, you know... It makes sense that this is a f***ing coat. Now that I look back at this in my head, it makes f***ing sense. So Eve deserved to die too? Oh, she did have a very annoying laugh. <laughs> annoying. And, and George Merchant? <laughs> they said annoying. And, and, and what about Tim Messenger? What was his crime? Our once great paper had become riddled with tabloid journalism. Not to mention persistent errors. He listed her age as 55. They killed a man over errors. Cousin Leslie was a terrible shame. She was set on moving away. We couldn't have her sharing her green fingers with anybody else. We can't have her. No one can. Hey, these, these motherfuckers are petty. These people die for no reason, no reason whatsoever. Oh, I wouldn't say that. Hello, Nicholas. How the are you doing? I believed in the immutable word of the law. I don't give a fuck. I'm taking that as a dub. I called him. I called him and Skinner. Now all these other motherfuckers. Y'all gotta give me credit. I don't give a fuck. Y'all gotta give me credit for this. Oh, we gotta kill Daddy's daddy. Oh. Daddy, no. Shut the fuck up. Daddy on his side? Daddy, you a whole bitch. Oh. Hey, man. I'll make sure everyone gets their justice. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. How do they got my man dead like this? I don't so angry. How do you dead like this? I had to pause it for a second just because um, we're going to talk about this who done it though. I'm taking credit for calling Skinner and in the, in the, in Danny's daddy. I'm taking credit for that. I'm going to claim a victory for the rest of them too. Like I'm going to give myself half a point. The second half of this movie is way better than the first half of this movie. So, hey, when that who done start kicking in, let me tell you, hey, these motherfuckers killed everybody over the most pettiest reason. They killed old boy because of his house. It didn't have the, the same look as everything else. They killed an old girl because just because she was leaving. They didn't want nobody else to have her green thumb. Just because she was leaving. 
they killed the old dude because he was misspelling words in a paper. And then they killed the other guy because of the damn drama club. And they run the town like this. They didn't kill them little kids over their hood. They didn't kill the motherfucking mom, dude. Like, he ain't done that to nobody. He just stands there like this. How can you be mad at somebody to stand there like this all day? Or like this all day? Or like that all day? Like, they are petty. Like, I'm happy I called the sheriff and... Well, they was throwing skin in my lap, you know what I'm saying? But I'm going to take it. I'm going to take credit for it anyway. I don't give a f I didn't. I did not know they were going to show me the whole city. And then Danny's bitch ass showed up and going to grab him. Like, <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I didn't. And hell, there's a cult. I didn't think Danny would be like, he's too f***ing goofy to be part of a cult. Huh. Hey, man. I'm going to tell you how fuzz is rotation moving. I still got 30 minutes left. Daddy, hey, Danny stabbed this out of him just now. Kind of look like he stabbed him more in the arm than anything else, but. Hey, Bob, I'm telling you, listen. If I'm ever in a situation with a bunch of old people, Ta -da. what are you doing? Shut the f up. I'm saving your skin. This is murder. It's not. It's ketchup. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about the others. What did you think was happening? Not this. It's Frank. He's appointing himself judge, jury, and executioner. What did he mean? He didn't, he didn't know what was happening. You just stabbed him. Go back to London. There's nothing you can do. I can come back. We can do it together. You and me. Partners. Hey, man, that's crazy as hell. But listen. I don't know why I would ever be in that situation. But if there's a group of old people chasing me, first of all, I'm not running. I'm going to fuck old people up. A group of 10, 10 people, 10 old people. I'll be breaking hips and kneecaps and all kind of shit. I'm talking about doing dumb shit that's like, uh, you're old. You're old as shit. Like, they like 70, 80 years old. I'll punch one of them in their elbow. They whole hip up. I'm fat. I'll run around in a circle. They can't pivot like that. Is there anything I can do for you? Shut the fuck up. No. This is something I have to do myself. I wish I knew how much that was. Oh, he bought spray paint, didn't he? He about to A. And them people supposed to be there tomorrow. So he about to spray paint the whole place. Shut the f*** up. He's a horrible shot. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. They, they, oh, just walk in. Look, look at that. Shut the f up, not commando. Someone from London called for you. Hey, listen. Um, he has a lot of shit from old people. Like the only one that's young is Skinner. Everybody else's grandparents. Want to do something useful? <laughs> they blocked all the cameras. Angel. Oh, we're fing the whole city up there. I hope the horse take it in the middle of town. Oh, he's better than me. I've been shooting out windows. I'd have shot him. Is he in on it? He's part of it too, ain't he? I'd have shot him. I'd have stole his hearing aid. He rode in on a white horse.
Let's get ready to rumble. Morning. I didn't know he was strapped up. Shut the f up. Little gang members right there. What's wrong with his fingernail? Gone. Can't walk again. He gotta get a walker. I'm glad he opened the door because he she was f***ing him up. It's the greatest shit ever. Hey, they ain't hit nobody. Ooh. Fascist! Hey. He got a sword. No, he got a cane. Man, if you don't kick that old man. No, he do have a sword. Thank you. I may not be a man of God, Reverend, but I know right and I know wrong. Fuck off, grasshopper. Jesus Christ! Nicholas! You can't! Listen. Why do everybody got shotguns? <laughs> Shut the f up. Not the saws, prep. Step away from the sergeant. No, Dad. Danny. Have you ever wondered why, why the crime rate in Sanford is so low, and yet the accident rate, it's so high? No. Yeah. What? <laughs> he, he said, no. Yeah. What? Sorry, I am completely lost. Sanford is a lie, Doris. For the last 20 years, the village has been controlled by Frank and the NWA. They've, they've lulled everyone into thinking this is a perfect village. I'm telling you, man. The NWA, hey. That's not what I thought this was going to be. <laughs> Officer Walker, stay here with Saxon and hold everything down. Like, you can't outrun a police dog. And they let the dog go, you're 80. You're not going to, f*** it. You can be 20, you're not outrunning a Jimmy Shepard. The longer we wait, more time they got to mobilize. I say we go in through the front entrance, take the place all by oil. Can he see? Very good, what he said. I mean, he's like this. Here come the fuzz. That's why they well, that's why it's called hot fuzz. I didn't think about that. I mean he been whooping his ass for an hour. Is this what you really, really want? Yeah. See yourself. Mm. Oh, and bro, just shoot him. I'd be like, bow, bow, next. They are f***ing this door up. Mm. I love Switch K. Why he, why he taking the Switch K? That's one of my favorite cereals. Oh, his back broke. He gone, folks. I ain't gonna lie, that was badass. Nice one, Doris. Why'd you hear her? Nothing like a bit of girl on girl. <laughs> Shut the f up. Listen. Never in a thousand years I think this story would go this way. This is amazing. How big are the engines in those cars? Like, I need to know. Ah! 
That's f-ing brilliant. Hey, for how fast are those cars go? Cause they so tiny. Bang, bang. Swan! Swan! I done ran that swan the fuck over. I'm sorry. It'd have been feathers everywhere. Swan! <laughs> they did right. That's why they didn't hurt nobody. But if I was the bad guys, I'd have trucked it. This is like, a, like an old school Power Rangers um, episode. <laughs> they turned up Angel Grove. Get out my face! Hey, Skitter is whooping his ass. It's not your village anymore! How do get. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was trying to make the other Street Fighter sound. It didn't work out. No, don't worry about it. Just overlook it. Pretend that you what? heard the other Street Fighter sound. Hey! Is that a box cutter? Ma'am, you don't sit your ass down. Why the f? Why would they do that? They could have just. Really? Uh, oh, stop talking. Stop talking. I'll tell you how this is gonna end! Shoot him in the ass! I shot him in the ass. Evan, why are you taking like that? What's wrong with him? That's <laughs> why. Come back to London. Sanford's hardly a fitting place for such an exceptional officer. Yeah, well, the thing is, sir... Uh, oh, no, it's no coming back! We broke up! I kind of like it here. Nah. Nah. I ain't coming back. Going to jail. Did he arrest George Washington? <laughs> Got the f*** up. Shut the f up. He got shot with a Daniel Boone. Oh, God, no. Oh, they're all dead. How did he get shot with a musket? Just hang on. Hang on. Everything's gonna be fine. Bro, he just got shot with a motherfucking Civil War gun. I know Daddy ain't dead. I know he did not die with this motherfucking Davy Crockett gun. I know he didn't. There's no way in hell. Hope these are okay. Yeah. They're lovely. Okay, I'm about to say, bro. Hey, I'm about to be mad as f Sergeant Butterman, little hand says it's time to rock and roll. Bring the noise. Hey, he would f out that car. All right, so we just got finished watching Hot Fuzz. And um, this movie's fucking amazing. This, this movie's great. It's great. The second half of this movie... Definitely took this movie to the next level for me. When the Who Done It start kicking in, all the action start kicking in. Once the Who Done It part got in there, like I was, I told you, I love Who Done It. It got real fun for me. 
I, I like this one a whole lot better than I like Shauna the Dead. The NWA, they are petty. They are they are so fucking petty, man. Like I, I like I've never expected the reason why all these killers is going on was for some petty ass shit. Cause they wanted the village of the year award. Dude, like that's so fucking petty. Hey man. That shit's so wonderfully ignorant. But yeah, there's a couple things I, I want. I'm curious. I need to know if that's Professor Slughorn. I can never I, I never know what he looked like outside of Harry Potter. Like I said, this is a rotation movie, man. I'll I will watch the shit out of this over and over and over again. Man, I really thought Danny was on the other side. Like I thought he stabbed the shadow. But like I thought he kinda like stabbed him in the arm. Like, you know what I'm saying? Matter of fact, I apologize to you, Daddy, because I called you out your name early. I apologize. I tend to act out early. You know what I'm saying? I, I tend to judge. I really hope y'all enjoy watching this with me. Cause I, I truly enjoy watching it for y'all. Before I get off it though, if you didn't know from earlier, I need you to like, comment, subscribe for me. Um, like I said, it really helps out the channel. Um, don't forget to check it out on Patreon. Um, speaking of Patreon, I'm gonna give a shout out to the VIPs. Give a shout out to Leslie, Trey, John Harold, Becca June, the beautiful dog Missy, a pretty girl, um, Big Al, Robin, Big Frank, Lost Opportunity, Cody Stoudemire, Paul Sawicki, Frost1997, Anna Rondo, Jeff Jernigan, Adam, Grady B. Olson, Red Tail Z, TJ Gingler, Thomas, The Brandons, Garrett, Elizabeth Esposito, Nicholas Jenkins, Super Nobody, Rachel Martinez, Jennifer and Natalie, BB98, Chris, Nareen, Nick, Cope Movies at Midnight, Jamie Gibson, Miguel Brooks, Caleb, Steve McCluzo, Echo, Peanut, Sammy, Zachary, Jonathan Patrick, Ryan, Rocket, and and Birdo. I want to thank all y'all for being VIPs. And I want to thank everybody else for being part of the family as well. Tell you all the time, y'all the best part of this channel. I can I can never thank y'all enough. Like me and Blank can never thank y'all enough, honestly. Really, thank you for all the love and support. It means more than you will ever know. Thank you. I'm gonna get off here. So y'all be good. Y'all be safe. Night night.